What is up, you guys? Welcome back. Welcome to today's video. I am freaking, I, I am chilling with Sony. I am chilling with an upcoming freaking rock star, aspiring, what are you, an aspiring agency owner, Sony? Are you an aspiring yeah. online marketer, Facebook advertiser? Sony reached out to me. What, what'd you do? You found me what? Where, where'd you find me? Facebook, YouTube, where'd you find me? YouTube, YouTube. You put out so much content that it just i just binge watched all your videos and and that's what's crazy sony it's like i'm trying to tell you man i'm trying to tell you pick your niche pick your interests pick your passion and just start talking about it in in 10 to 20 minute video segments and put those videos on youtube that's what i'm trying to tell you man Facebook Live is one thing. Like I was peeping your stuff and, and you're doing some, man, you're coming with it. You're really, really coming with it. And I'm proud of you because, because I, know, I know where you're at in the process. And that's why I'm glad we're, we're jumping on to do a Q&A just so you can really pick my brain and I can really guide you and, 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 and maybe take you down a path faster than how I you know, may have had to go down it. Um, but I, but I, I think it, it, it's simple, man. When you can start putting out content like that and look where my channel is at, my channel is not even that big right now. Like I'm a little over a thousand subscribers on YouTube. I'm taking this interest that I have in Facebook ads, online marketing, internet marketing, and, and I'm talking about it. Right. And I'm attracting people like you, people like you are finding me. People are reaching out. They're like, damn, David, can you help me with some stuff? I got some questions. And it's like, man, I find that so humbling. I find that so like, like, like insanely touching where I'm like, man, hell yeah, I'll give that person my time. If they really had the courage to reach out and be like, hey man, I have some questions, I'm fired up, you know, and, and, and if you can take your message and touch people like that, it's like, dude, that's something special. But what I'm saying is that in today's era, in 2020 and beyond, to be able to take this type of content and put it on YouTube, and, and touch people, but on the back end, have YouTube start sending you money. Like I'm, I, I dropped a video about this a couple of days ago. They just sent me my first check. YouTube, all because I'm putting out these videos that are finding that, that people like Sony are finding and they're actually learning something from it. And they're like, damn, I want more. And it's like, I'm telling you, Sony, where we're at, it's, it's just an amazing opportunity. It's an amazing opportunity to connect with you. It's an amazing opportunity what we have right now online and not everyone's, not everyone's, you know, um, um, understanding it. And, and just, just before I hit record, I was telling Sony, I was getting ready to tell Sony just the beginning, like, cause how she found me was that I was out there in Bonita. I was right there. I had a, I had a little office out there in Bonita and she was around that area. She's familiar with the area. We're from the same city. And, and the first piece of advice I threw at her and I'm like, dude, don't get an office like, like you don't need to have that expense because where we're at today, man, with the internet, with social media, with building a business, where we're at today is a laptop, a Wi-Fi connection and a cell phone. That's it. Like I can have my backpack butt naked on some Island <laughs> building a business, building a business because of the internet and because of social media, like it's insanely, insanely crazy. And not everyone gets it. Not everyone's going to be an online marketer. No, my wife has no idea like she, what, what I do. Like, and she, and she doesn't want to know what I do. You know what I mean? It's like, that's not her. That's not everyone, but the people that are, that are like us, that's why I appreciate Sony man reaching out and, 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 and just saying, Hey man, can you help me? Like that's, that's the first step. That's the first step you have to, to be a great leader. You have to be a student to be a, a great leader. Someday you have to be a follower. You have to be a good follower. To be a good coach, you have to be a good student, right? So shout out to Sony. Shout out to Sony. Sony, let me share this screen because I want everybody following you. This is your page right here, right? Sony Million Dollar Marketing? Yes. Yes, awesome. that's my page. Awesome. Awesome, man. So tell me what's on your mind. That's, and that's why you guys, I wanted to turn this into content. I was telling Sony, I'm like, everything we do is going to be content. You're going to take that. And if you're interviewing someone, if you're, if you're just, you know, chopping it up with someone, try to do it on zoom, try to do it on, 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 in video where you can, where you can take that and, and, and repost it. You can edit it. You can turn little segments into it. And that could be an Instagram post, or you could take little segments of it and, 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 and post it on LinkedIn, or you could take the full video and upload it to your YouTube channel. And all of a sudden start building a YouTube channel. That's what I'm saying, man. I saw your Facebook lives on Facebook earlier all that good stuff, I'm telling you, only because I saw my first YouTube check. 
it was worth it. It was worth it. Like it took me a couple years, but I, but I wasn't the most consistent putting up these videos at all. I'm literally telling my 12 year old son, he just dropped his first video yesterday. Yesterday, I'm saying, boy, you better build a YouTube channel because all the content that you're that you're about to put out like with you sony you did the facebook live it was it, it was your first one in a long time i saw you i saw you you were like damn i'm i'm nervous right but it's like hey like this one down here but you were like screw it my reason why is stronger than strong and i'm gonna just do it that's what you were saying on this one right and this was this was this was on the 27th mm -hmm. were you nervous as hell or what Oh man, I I was shaking. I oh my goodness. Um I knew what I was going to say. I knew that I had an introduction, but I also knew, you know, my my personal family, my personal friends, they were all on there. And so I knew that if I want to make something of myself, I have to put myself out there. Yes. You know? Yes. So I just said you know what, doesn't matter what location I'm in, doesn't matter what's happening, I got to tell people what I'm doing. And so here's my biggest, 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 biggest piece of advice. Everything you got in your chest, everything you got in your head, all that knowledge, everything you're about to unload, you're about to go out there and get some coaches. You're about to go out there and help some coaches make more money by running Facebook ads, right? That's what you're trying to do, right? And that's the goal. That's the, that's the goal. That's what, what, what we're in it for. And, and, and you're going to, you're going to crush it, man. You're going to crush it. You're going to crush it. And as you start to put out this content, that's all I'm saying. All I'm saying is as you start to dump out this content, like the one you, you did right there, the one you did up here recently, as you start to, to dump out this content, also take that video and upload it to YouTube. Okay. That's what I'm saying. And, and learn how to learn how to, to, to upload it and optimize it the right way. So when you upload the video, write out the description, put a good title, put um, um, links in the description, um, put keywords and tags in the, the um, in while you're uploading it. Um, and, 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 and consistently do that consistently upload videos to YouTube, a minimum of three times per week. I told my little boy, man, he's 12 years old. I said, dude, you are going to upload a video. And, and he's now, he's in a gaming. So he's going to be, screen, he's sharing his screen and he's freaking uploading videos of him playing a, a video game and he's, and he's going to build a channel around that. And I said, three times a week, you're going to put up, you know, 30 minute videos, three times per week. And you're going to do that for the next six years. I'm telling this to my 12 year old. Because that content that he would have put on Facebook, that content that he would have put on Instagram, that content that he would have put on LinkedIn, it, it, it would have been random content that's lost in the news feed three seconds later. On YouTube, people, you can build an audience. Like, dude, my channel is so small, but I'm finding amazing people like Sony. Like I'm finding amazing people that, that, that are, that are, that are, that, that are going to turn into something huge. Like, and, and it's like that same content that you would have that. Okay. You put it over here on Facebook. I'm, ch I'm just telling you put it on YouTube as well. All I do, all I do, the only way you found me, I'm not even doing this video on any of my other pages. I'm not doing it on Instagram. That's just me. Like it's not the right way at all. I'm just saying what I've done and how you still found me. All I've done is I've taken this video and rather than putting it on Facebook, rather than putting it on my personal page, my business page, rather than putting it on LinkedIn, rather than putting it on Instagram, rather than even putting it on Twitter, rather than putting that same, it took the same energy, same topic, same eight minute video, same everything, same everything. I just put it on YouTube. And that's what I've been doing like, you know, since since 2017, but not, not the most consistent, but I think I, I think I finally cracked the code somewhat where my, where now my channel is growing. Cause I think I learned, I think I know how to do it now. And, 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 and these little things that you do to optimize that video and put it on YouTube rather than just relying on putting it here, this needs to be on YouTube. And I'm telling you in a, in a year, in a, in a year, if you put up three videos per week like this, you put one up right here, you put one up, you put one up on the personal page on the 27th. So if you did that three times a week and you put that up on YouTube, you're still going to be building an audience, but now on the back end, you're going to also start monetizing. 
that's freaking powerful uh-huh. like absolutely powerful because all all people are doing is they're putting that dude this message right here was fire you kidding me that was a good message that was a good video you were freaking on video kicking game answering questions over here you're kicking more game you're on video but i'm just saying that when we do it on all these other platforms it just it's it's just there like and and then and then as i'm going to the news feed i'm only going to see that if i'm your friend and i'm only going to see it in the news feed it's not like i'm going to your page and stalking you you know what i mean like i'm going to end up seeing that like we see our friends this is my friend I'm only seeing her stuff here in the news feed. It's not like I'm going to her page. You know what I mean? So it's like, dude, people are seeing that, that video that you did. They're seeing it for two seconds and then they just keep scrolling or they watch it or whatever. I just rather have it on freaking YouTube and being able to monetize that in the future. You know what I mean? Um, D- does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes are you, are you building a YouTube channel? Uh, I have a YouTube channel. I actually already put videos on there, but that was like last year. So yeah. I really gotta go back on my YouTube channel and start uploading videos again. You you got to do that for sure, and that's what I'm telling you because you're already about to start doing that. 2020, I could see you crushing video in 2020, but 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 I, I but I, but from what I'm seeing, I'm seeing you start the pattern. I'm starting to, I'm starting to see you start the pattern on your personal page, mm-hmm. where 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 that same energy, that same eight minute. That same conversation, I'm just saying that needs to go on YouTube. Okay. Because I'm telling you, you do that three times a week. In 12 months, you would have built a YouTube channel and a following. And and now YouTube is going to start paying you money. That's crazy. That money could be used for advertisement. That money could be used for a car payment. That money could be used for groceries. You're putting the content out already. You're trying to get a hold of coaches already. You're trying to give these marketing tips already. You're doing it in video already. Let me just park it on YouTube rather than rather than having a now now go ahead and park it everywhere else. Park it on Facebook, park it on Instagram. Go ahead. But it ain't gonna do nothing. Let's take that same video. And and look, because of what I'm telling you, I took that same video, I only parked it on YouTube, and that's how you found me. Now you didn't find me right away. I yep. probably put a hundred videos up before Sony found me, but she found me, mm-hmm. and that's all that matters. And it and it only happened that way. It wasn't because she saw my videos and started watching and binging and watching all my videos on LinkedIn. No, she didn't do it that there because I don't put them there. I don't even put them on Instagram. I don't even put them on my Facebook business page. On my Facebook business page, look how cracking my facebook business page is over here look over here you come over here this one needs to be on your page okay so your link is on your page which is awesome but here's what happens when i come to your page versus coming to my page over here here's my business page right here's your business page the moment Mm -hmm. i come the moment i land so i came to your personal page i clicked on that link you're over here talking marketing services you're over here talking facebook ads for coaches right you're over here talking talking marketing and sales funnels. But when I come to the business page, I see 28 likes. That's the first impression. Okay. That's the first impression. So this, what I'm kicking right now is going to answer a lot of your questions that you probably have as well. But then also, my, you're not even probably thinking of this stuff. You're, you're probably coming to this call thinking, David, just thinking, you know, David, just tell me the technicals. Tell me how exactly how to run the ad or maybe something like that. But I'm telling you what everyone's missing. Like what everyone's missing is that credibility and that social proof. Look, I come to your page, I see 28 likes. You come to my page, this is my page over here. You come to my page and you just scroll down and you see 10,000. You see that? Mm-hmm. That's a, is, that a, is that a difference in perception? What do you think? Yeah, it's a, it's a huge difference. I actually um, was going to ask you about that because, yeah, because um, I actually, it's not like I just made the page. I have the page for like a good year. Oh, and, yeah. Um, 
and I know that I have to, you know, get my likes up. I have to get my brand, my credibility up. Um, I was just, you know, confused as to how to do that. You know? Yes. Yes. So um, it was that and, and also the strategy session as well. Um, really what to say, like, if you know Facebook ads, you know how they work, you know everything, but you're really trying to get, like, you know, that first client. Yes. And you don't want to tell them something that, you know, they go do and then it's all wrong and, and you get, like, scared and stuff that they're going to come at you and, and scream at you and stuff like that. Yes. Um, just really, like, you know, I, I know you have a bunch of strategy calls on your uh, YouTube videos. I've been watching that as well. So I've really been trying to get like a base of what to say. Only thing is, you know, you're very established. You've been doing this for like, what, 17, 18 years. And then there's people like us that, you know, just started. So I just wanted to see how you would really, you know, get into that when you're just beginning. Yes. And, and, and that's exactly, exactly what I'm, I'm showing you exactly what I'm showing you. I'm using your page as an example. Mm -hmm. Exactly what I'm showing you is telling you what you have to do. I'm, I'm telling you exactly what to do because, because these little things make a difference. And then I'm, mm -hmm. and then I'm also telling you the service that I'm providing to these people. So, so, so I'm, you're, I, I'm literally, I'm literally throwing, I'm literally saying two things at once right now, now, now to you. So I'm, I'm telling you in a way where it's like, dude, from a friend to a friend, here's what you want to do first. And then I'm also telling you exactly how I'm telling it to you, but how I would be telling it to a client. So it's okay. like, it's like, it's like you're a prospect right now and I'm presenting to you right now. This is exactly what I'm pointing out to you. So what I'm telling you right now, it was step one. When I came to your personal Facebook page, there was a link to this page right here. This is your business page, right? When I come to this business page, when anyone comes to this business page, I'm saying this number is what stands out. So again, I'm telling you this from, from a friend to a friend, we need to get your number up, but I'm also telling you how I talk to clients. I'm also telling you exactly what I'm pointing out to them. These are the basics that I start with. So when I'm, when I'm getting my first client, I'm not getting them at 2,500 a month. No, they don't even know me yet. Like they don't even know my work yet. Like they don't even, I don't even know them yet. Like, although I think I can help coaches, I still haven't got my first legit one. So, so therefore I'm still kind of testing myself. So I don't want to charge someone a lot of money. What I'm going to charge them is I'm going to charge them a few hundred to go clean up some stuff. And that's why I use Zoom so I can visually point this stuff out. This is step one. This is exactly what I'm pointing out. When I come to your personal page, let's start from the beginning. This is step one. And again, I'm telling you that you need to up your game because you're going to use your page as an example to show it to them. Okay. So this is what I'm telling you. Hey, coach, when I come to your personal page, coach, you got this going on. So, so good for you to have that link right there. It takes, it takes someone straight to your business page. So good job on that. But what's okay. missing, coach, what's missing are all of your social media links. So this okay. is what I see when I come to your personal page. And then the coach might say, well, hey, David, that's my personal page. I have everything on my business page. Okay, that's fine, coach. But I'm talking to your personal page. I'm talking about your personal page. Your personal page is just as important as that business page. You are a brand. You are a personal brand. You're trying to build something. So this personal page is just as important. Here's what's missing over here. I'm telling it to you as a friend from a David to a Sony, and I'm telling you exactly how I'm showing it to a prospect. I'm saying, hey, man, this is what yours look like. And then you come over to mine. You come over to mine, and this is what mine looks like. So, coach, here's what I'm saying. Here's what I'm offering. Here's what I'm telling you I need to do for you. I need to list all your links. Your Instagram ain't showing. Look at mine. Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, LinkedIn, my dot com. Now I come to yours, coach. I come to yours and you got it going on. You started the right. You At least you got, you know, one part of it, right? You got your business page. Great job. But what about Instagram, LinkedIn, Pinterest, Twitter? 
What about your website address? And don't show me your ugly looking Calendly link. Ain't nobody want to see that. Like it, it just doesn't look right. So rather than rather than having that, we're missing. Let, let's just let's just list all of our links like this. This is what I'm telling a business owner. And 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 when I compare it, when when I show him mine, and 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 then I go back and show him his, he's like, "Damn, David, I'm over here building a business. We've been in business for 15 years, or whatever it may be." They're telling you, and they don't even have base the, the basics down. I tell them, I, I I tell them, I say, "Hey, man, this is the basics." This is step one. Yes, I can go run Facebook ads for you. Yes, I can charge you fifteen hundred a month. Yes, I could freaking you know go out there and put your pixel and create sales funnels and landing pages. Yes, it's going to cost per month for anyone to do that for you. And I'll start small with you. I'm not greedy. I, I, I'm not asking for twenty five hundred a month. I'll start small. But that's what I call step three, four, and five. Coach, we ain't there yet. Step one is listing all these links. Your page looks ridiculous right now. I need it to look like mine. I'm going to put your Instagram, your Twitter, your LinkedIn. I'm going to log into each platform. I'm going to customize it. I'm going to make it look all legit. And whatever username, whatever name we're going to brand, your company name, your coach name, whatever the heck you want, whatever that one name is, these are the platforms. And, I'll, uh, and I'm, also, I'm also going to get the .com. I'm also going to go out there and get the .com so I can list that and match it as well. I want everything to match. That's step one. Step two, coach, step two is when people come to your business page, they cannot see 29. When people come to my business page, look what they see. And that happened with a simple Facebook ad. It ain't because I'm more popular than you. It ain't because I'm more established than you. It's because I ran a simple Facebook ad and I took it up thousands of likes for literally the cost of lunch. If I took you out to lunch right now, we'd spend more at lunch than it cost me to run that ad. So it ain't because I'm better than you. I just, I just, this is step two. I just understand social media marketing. I understand social media branding. And this is basic stuff that everyone misses. Everyone and their mother is calling you right now. Everyone wants to do your marketing services. Everyone's pitching you on running Facebook ads. Yeah, whatever. Everyone's charging two grand a month, whatever. But ain't nobody teaching you this. And this is the most important. Unless people know that you're on social media, you come to my page. Look, they're going to know right away I'm on Instagram, Twitter. They're going to they're gonna know exactly where to find me. And, and when I bring them to my web page, I'm Facebook pixeling them. I don't know why the links for some reason aren't working on Facebook and and um, and Instagram for some reason. It's super super weird. Look, it's taking me to a. That's weird. That's super weird. I started noticing that, and I sent Facebook a message as well. But when they click on that, they're coming over here where I'm also Facebook pixeling them. So, so, so I tell the coach, man, I tell the coach, I say, Hey man, you got a website. Okay, cool. What's your website? Is that the one listed on your page? Okay, cool. It's not listed on your page. What do you mean? Look, this is what most coaches, their intros look like, Sony. This is, I'm telling you how to get money right now. I'm telling you exactly how to get money right now. I'm telling you how you're going to reach out to a coach and you're going to look at their profile. You're going to look at their Facebook personal profile. It all starts here. You're not going to, all of them are going to look like yours. And a lot of them aren't even going to have their business page link. So it's like, at least you got that part. Most of them aren't even going to have that. If they have it, then great. But here's step one. They don't have everything else. And that's hurting their brand. Would you agree that this looks a little better than yours? Yeah, yeah. Um, it's just, you know, does your social media accounts, do they have to be business too? Because I have all of them. They're just, they're not business my main business there, there's my there, there's no such thing as personal in business there's no such thing man you want one account for everything keep it personal keep it business call it what you want post you post you keep it real keep it authentic post you whether that's personal whether it's business whatever it's one account for everything you don't need multiple accounts you don't you don't okay. people people gravitate to you man it, they ain't gravitating to your business account like no they're gravitating to sony everyone's building their own audience. Remember that, man. You're building your own audience. The whole world ain't going to like you. 
nor do, nor do we need to cater to the whole world. You're building a very specific niche. And in your case, it's coaches who want to run Facebook ads. That's a very specific want that you got right there. Mm -hmm. Very specific. So, so I'm trying to tell you that before you get 2000 a month out of them to run a Facebook ad, I'm telling them, don't, I'm telling you, don't leave money on the table because up front right now, month number one, they'll write you a check right now for a few hundred to go do this for them right now. Go do this basic, basic service and, and, and go make their page look like this. And when you go to the business page, look, when I go to your business page and I click, not only do I see the 29 likes, which is a turnoff. If Sony is really all that, why aren't 2,900 people liking her page? That's how people think, right? That's the only reason why when you land on my page and you see 10,000, you're like, damn, he must be really doing it. No, I ain't. I just ran a simple Facebook ad. It's the perception. It's the perception. So, so, so on your business page over here, that like count needs to be higher. And then on, when I click on about, this is what you're showing me. When I click about, you're showing me this many chat link. You're showing me your Gmail, which looks un unprofessional, like the name. It don't even match with the name of the page. Look, when you look at my page, Here's my, here's my business page. We click about, here's the difference. So when I click about, this is what I see, your phone number and that. When you click about on my page, this is what you see. So it all starts with that username and then you scroll down and then you, and the, there's my mini chat link, just like yours. There's my email. So my email, it's matching the .com. It's matching the Twitter, the Instagram, the Pinterest, the Snap, it's, it's, it, this, is, this is LinkedIn and, and, and um, that's LinkedIn and, and Pinterest. I don't know why the icon's not showing, but, but that's, that's how your page needs to look. That's step one. I'm telling you, who, whatever guru you've been learning from on how to build a social media agency or how to run Facebook ads for clients, that's, that, that's later on. This right here is basic stuff that I truly believe people like you that are starting out you can you can easily 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 get money to do that from clients right now versus trying to get someone for two grand a month right now you're not going to get someone for two grand a month right now and, and, unless you're really with it with sales funnels and landing pages which which are you i i don't even know are you or what what software do you use for your landing pages you're, you're cutting out what did you say Yeah, you cut out. Are you on a phone? Are you on Wi-Fi? I, I know how to do it. Um, I was try to turn up your volume. And it, it looks weird. Huh? Try to, turn, try to turn up your volume. No. Hold on. Can you hear me? Yeah, now I can. I couldn't okay. before. Do you use Kartra? Okay. So, yeah. So, so I, I started with click funnels first, but now I'm really getting more into Kartra because it's easier and it's more like, you know, I'm more able to understand it better. So I'm really looking into that. I know how to do sales funnel, but I'm really looking into how to do it right now. And, and that's, 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 that's the most important. Like, so if you're telling me, okay, I'm a coach and you want to run Facebook ads for me, it's very simple. We got to first know Facebook mm -hmm. ads. That's one thing. And then we have to drive that click to a landing page to capture an email. That's the other thing. And that's it. So it's like, that's, that's what people are charging 1500, 2000, 2500 a month. That's what people are charging for. Okay. But if, if you don't have that track record right now, it's going to be a little bit more challenging for you to go do that and, and request that kind of money from someone right now. My whole approach to it is mm -hmm. where for the past few years, since 2016, when I rolled my little thing out, my agency, and I started getting clients and I started learning how to run Facebook ads for them. And I just knew that my skill level wasn't at 2000 a month at that point. And, and so, so with my niche, I started looking at other things on social media 
I started looking at their profiles and I'm like, wait a minute, they're missing all this stuff. They're trying to build a brand. They're over there trying to build a business, but their social media is missing a lot of important information. And so I started looking at this stuff and that's where this came from. That's where this came from where I'm like, damn, none of their pages look legit. Like if I, like that's what I'm saying, this is step one. Like if you can really look at yours and, 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 and then look at everybody else's, is there a difference? Is there not a difference versus my personal page and my about section of my business page? That step alone, is that not a difference between yours and mine? Yeah, it's, it's a huge difference. It's a huge difference. And that's basic stuff, Sony. That's what I'm saying. You'll have these, these coaches will pay you 500 without a shadow of a doubt, without a, without a doubt, without a hesitation. They'll, they'll, they'll hand you a credit card for, for at least 500 right now to go do that and make their brand look super legit. They'll, they'll pay 500 all day for that. And when you can close a few of those per week, it's not bad income up front. While you're, and, and here's, here's what you're offering at a $500 price point, for example. You're offering to customize all of those links, and then you're also offering them to take this like count to at least, if they're giving you 500 bucks, you're taking that like count to at least, at least, at least 5,000 likes. Mm -hmm. At a $500, they give you $500 right now. You could take this like count to 5,000 and you could, and, and you can list all of their links. So when, when people come to their about section, now it looks legit. You got every link freaking matching and now their brand looks good. That's going to be their company name. They're fired up. You did step one and you ran a like ad and took their like count because everyone and their mother has, has 29 likes. When you go look at everyone, whatever, what everyone's doing is they're clicking invite. They're inviting their friends on their personal page to come like their business page. That's what everybody is doing. Every coach, every doctor, every restaurant, every chiropractor, every real estate agent, anyone who has a Facebook business page, they also have a personal page. And they're on that personal page all day, just like you are. And they're inviting those people. Every single coach, when you come to their Facebook business page, they got 300 likes. Every, every single one of them, 200 likes. You go to some of these coaches, their business page, they got 157 likes. It's like, no, bro, let's take that to 5,000. You're going to pay me 500. I'm going to take your like count from 450. I'm going to take it to 5,000. Okay. And I'm going to do step one. And, and we're going to take care of that first. And then we'll go on to step three. I already know what you want, coach. You want a lead. You want an appointment. You want to run Facebook ads. I get it, but we're not there yet. You're going to do this first because, because again, looking at my pages, you just told me there was a huge difference. I want your brand and I need your pages to look like that too because prospects are, are saying the same thing about your page. Your page looks black. That's what prospects are saying right now. So if you're a coach, I want to work with a coach where I come to their page and, and, and everything is set up and looks legit. I want to work with a coach that has thousands of people following him. That's the coach I want to work with. I ain't going to work with a coach that has 57 likes. You know what I mean? D just, the, just the like count, the perception means everything for your brand. That's all I'm saying. That's what it, where it starts. People will give you a few hundred all day to go do that. And then once you do that, you can eat, you can feed your family. You're, you're, you're charging people 500. Look, I, I, again, my links are all listed. And then step two, I took mine at 10,000. I'm telling you right now, if you charge people 500 bucks and you took them up to 5,000 likes, now, now, now you have to learn how to run that ad, which I can teach you, that'll be another call. But I could teach okay. you how to run that exact ad where, where your profit margin on it is absolutely ridiculous. And, 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 if you, and if you can close a few of those clients per week, that's where you start them. You close a few of those per week. Let's just say you close, you close two a week. You're making $1,000 a week up front by doing those services, those two services right now. You're closing a couple of, a couple, two new ones every week, which is, a, which is, which is 1000 a week up front.
okay, a thousand a week. At the end of the month, you closed three, six, nine, twelve. You closed twelve. Actually, let's just say it's two a week. You closed eight clients for the month. Okay, eight people gave you five hundred bucks. Eight people. Okay, out of the eight, two of them are going to come back. Two of them are going to come back at the end of the month. Month number two. At the end of the month, out of the eight clients that you got five hundred each out of to go do step one and two for. Two of them are going to come back and say, Sony, I'm ready for step three. I'm ready to start running Facebook ads. And that's when you take them to a thousand a month. Okay. That's how, that's how I've done it, Sony. That's how I've done it. So. Okay. And can I actually um, take a moment? Like, uh, sorry, sorry. It's all you. Turn can your volume take, up. Like, Turn your volume up and, and try, to put, try to get on camera. Put, put your phone down or something. There you go. Perfect. I can see you now. And then try to turn up your volume. Go ahead. It's all you. Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Can I take five minutes to just praise you for a minute? Because I actually, um, I have watched your videos since last year. And your uh, DM strategy video, I don't know if you uh, remember that one. The one where you uh, go through all five DMs that people can send you. Yes. That one. Um, I actually implemented it. I sent that to 50 of my prospects and nine of them came back and said they were interested. See, and, and, and as you get better at that, Sony, as you start to get better at that, I'm telling you, you, you I'm, I'm telling you, I'm telling you how you'll be able to feed your family at least on the upfront while you're while you're learning facebook ads while you're because that's where you're going to spend your time you're going to spend your time mastering facebook ads and you're going to spend your time which 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 is instagram ads as well that's where i would spend all your time and then you, and then you need a kartra system you need landing pages you need an email autoresponder you need you need to start hosting you need you need a calendar and you want it all in one software like i love click funnels i love russell brunson but it's just the landing pages and then i got to go pay for a separate service for the email autoresponder and then if i want to if i want to start making yeah. videos and start doing courses i have to go get a different service for that so there's just multiple services where everything is in one with kartra so you should get get good at that so as you're getting good at that as you're getting good at landing pages as you're getting good getting good at at running facebook ads you're closing a couple clients per week at 500 a pop. That's the upfront money that's going to feed your family and pay your bills. And then, mm -hmm. and then at the end of the month, you'll have those monthly, monthly retaining clients that have an actual thousand a month to bring you aboard. And that's when you really start. And you're, and, 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 and you're only going to have a handful of those in the beginning. In the meantime, you're learning, you're perfecting your craft. In the meantime, you're mastering Facebook ads. In the meantime, you're closing people on step one and two, and they're giving you 500 each. And you're doing a couple of those per week. I know you could do three or four of them per week if you really, really tried. If you were direct messaging, you know, let's just say five hours a day, treating it like a drop, like a real job, like a part-time job around your other job if you have another job, but you treat it seriously and you're actually DMing for five hours a day. And 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 if you were doing that, I know for a fact you could be doing you could be closing three to four deals a week at five hundred a pop. And that's not bad money, man, up front. Because I just truly believe everyone that's trying to build something like this, they think they have to have to go charge twenty five hundred a month. No, you don't. Your skill level is not even there yet to justify twenty five hundred a month from someone. Okay. So, so until our skill level gets there, what am I going to do? Starve? No, I got to figure out different services that I can provide, lower ticket services that I can really make sure that I can that I can that I can execute on, that I, that I can make that I can build myself. Okay, I'm gonna go after coaches. Let me go request every coach on Facebook on the personal page. Let me go request every coach. Get good on the personal page with them and then start messaging them and then start getting them on appointments and start showing them, hey, man, here's what your page looks like right now, Mr. Coach. Let me show you my page. That's how it should be. Let me show you your business page, Mr. Coach. Let me show you my page. That's how it should be. Here's what I can do for you right now, Mr. Coach. I know you want leads. I know you want appointments. I know you want someone to run Facebook ads. I know you want to learn how to run Facebook ads. I already know what you want, but I'm going to tell you what you're missing. And, and, and since you ain't got the 2000 a month that I'm going to want, 
since you ain't got that right now, let me show you something that we need to implement no matter what. Here's step one, here's step two. Put out, put out a, put down 500, I'll go out there and run it for you and do it for you. Um, and then what I also do, Sony, what I also do, here's what you wanna start doing. You wanna start getting people, your clients, to start doing reviews. Everyone that you do step one and two for, everyone that you do step one and two for, look, on my page over here, you click on reviews, Everyone that I do step one and two for, this is a new page. I just started doing this, this page, but I got 22 reviews already. At least, at least I'm starting, right? Like it's like everyone that I go do step one and two for, I have them come over here and, and give me a good review. So that's what you're going to start doing over here. Everyone that you go and do step one and two for, they're going to pay you 500. Your profit margin, your profit on that is absolutely ridiculous all you're doing is running the facebook ad and once i show you how to run the facebook ad um 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 your your profit margin is absolutely ridiculous it's ridiculous it's not even funny i, I don't want to say that number on, on online right now but but that's what i'm saying you can eat you can feed your family you could pay your bills on a few of those per week and then and then at the end of the month you're going to have your monthly clients come back to you and say david i got the budget I'm ready for, for step number three. I'm ready to start running Facebook ads and start capturing leads. Sony, you're my, you're my right hand. Let's do it. That's when you have your clients. You close, you close three, a week, you close two a week. You're making a thousand a week. Take home. That's your net thousand a week. You got a Stripe account. You're taking their credit card number. You're processing that credit card through your Stripe account. You're doing it all online. You're doing it manually yourself. You take the credit card number over, over zoom like this. And then, and then, um, and then and then and then you knock out step one and two you make them come give you a good review and then again man you're gonna have those monthly clients those people that come back sony you did a phenomenal job on step one and two now i'm ready for step three let's start running facebook ads that 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 that's had that that's been my whole approach man and if you guys are catching this on youtube my link is in the is in the description is is digitalagencyblueprint.com make sure you're on that vip Sony's on that list. I'm going to make sure that you guys are, are up to date on, on how I'm building my agency. And because, because I truly believe that that's, 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 that's a beginner level right there for, for you, Sony. Does that make sense? Yeah. Do you think you can, I mean, does that, it does, does that take pressure off or does that, does that, does that seem more real than, than maybe what you were trying to do? Like, do you have any clients right now paying you a lot of money per month? Um, no, I am complete. Like I've done Facebook ads for myself before, yeah. but never for other clients. And this yeah. actually makes it extremely clear for me because there was so many like gurus and mentors telling me, oh, just straight up charge people. Like it doesn't matter what experience you have. It's like, oh. charge a lot though, right? Charge a lot. Yeah. 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 And I'm like, yeah, no one's going to just, just pay hand me over money if I haven't helped other people. So I need like a step-by-step -step on like how to really start and then grow to, you know, an established industry, you know? So this actually really, really helps out. Thank you. Here, here's, here's what I want you to think of and here's what I want to leave you with is, mm -hmm. is the fact that on your personal page, we need to get those links listed. Instagram, LinkedIn, Pinterest, Twitter, and your dot com. Everything, just like on my page right here, everything needs to be matching. This is what okay. you need to do your, to your page right away. So think of that one name, whatever that one name is that we're going to brand, whether it's million dollar marketing, if that's the one name, we need, to, we need to make sure that we edit this username. That needs to match. Now, the title, you have a title on every platform, and then you have a username. What I'm telling you to match are the usernames. Match okay. the usernames. Okay, you got facebook.com forward slash million dollar com. Whatever that one name is, it needs to match all platforms, and you need to get the dot com. And the way you want to get the dot com, here's how you want to get the dot com. You're going to go to Google. You're going to go to, you're going to, go to Google. Let me, um, okay, you're going to go to Google, right? Make sure you're at google.com. Go to Google and you're going to type in cheap domains. Mm -hmm. And then you'll be able to get the GoDaddy, um, the discount right here. Look for the GoDaddy ad. It'll be 99 cents. Okay. So 
that is how you get that next.com. You can click on this, go to GoDaddy, register, register it through GoDaddy. I've been using GoDaddy for literally 20 years, probably as long as you've been born, Sony. I've been okay. using GoDaddy. But this is, this is a way where you can get that first one for, for a buck. And that's the one you're going to use to put on all of your social media platforms. And that's going to be the one that you use to match with all of your links. So just like my links right here, everything is matching with that one name. That's what you're going to do, your, to, do to your page. You're going to do that to your personal page. And then you're going to list all of those links in the about section of your business page. Once you do that, once you do that and everything is looking legit, just like this, you come over here to my page, you click about and you, and you, and you, and you see everything listed from the email to the dot com to all the platforms. Once you have that listed, that's step one. Once you have that, reach back out to me and we'll set up another call. And that's when I'll show you how to run that like ad to now take your like count to a few thousand. And I'm going to show you how to do that at the cost, at the cost of what it would take. You, you, you probably spend more at Starbucks than, than what it's going to take to run a like ad. And, and that like ad, okay. again, when people come to my page and they see that like number, that's what's going to grab their attention. They're either going to see 29 likes or they're going to see 2,900. I need them to see 2,900. And so as you start to talk to coaches, you, this is exactly what you're, you're, you're using Zoom so you can, you can look at their page and compare it to your page. Your page needs to be at 2,900. So when, I come, when I'm talking to clients, our prospects, and I bring them over here and I say, hey, man, does that number not paint a different picture when you see it? They're like, mm -hmm. hell yeah, it does, David. I'm like, okay, coach, I need to run that ad for you. That's where we need to be first. So, that, so, so just like you're thinking that you need to run ads and capture leads, I get it. But this ad needs to be ran first. And, and, okay. and, if, and if you don't got the thousand a month or if you ain't got the 1500 a month or the 2000 a month, that's fine. But you're going to have to drop a few hundred and we're going to need to take your light count up a few thousand and I'll do it for you. I'll also do step number one. So it looks, so your page looks like mine and all those links are listed and our brand looks good. Our brand needs to look good before we go and start, try to capture leads with everyone in our local community. Like our brand needs to look good. Right. Okay. And that's, mm -hmm. where I, that's, that's where I start them, Sony. That's where I start them. And, and I'm telling you, that they'll, they'll, they'll cut me. They'll give me that credit card all day. And, and they'll give me that credit card for 500 minimum all day on just doing that. You know, okay. you know, some of my clients, look, I have this one client. Look, this is, this is one, one client that I literally did exactly what I'm telling you. Step one, I listed all of her links. None of this was there before. Every, every page looks like yours. You got to know that. The personal page, you look at all these coaches, their personal page look blank just like yours. You look at their business page, they got 29 likes like you. I'm telling you. And then when you, and then when you, show, it, when you show this to them, they're like, damn, I wasn't even thinking about that. And that you are right. Your page looks way better. Look, we click about. Now, we have all of her links. Romina sells NJ. Romina sells NJ. Romina sells NJ. Romina sells NJ. She paid me to do that. And then I click on home and I come look at her likes. I scroll down. I scroll down and boom. What do I see? 7,200 likes. She didn't cut me a check for 500. She cut me a check for 700 because she wanted to go up 7,000 likes. Okay. She cut me a check for 700. And, and I don't even want to tell you the profit margin because you'll probably pee your pants on what it cost me to run the ad versus what I charged her. It took me like 30 minutes to list all of her links. She didn't have nothing listed. It looked blank just like yours. Mm -hmm. It took me 30 minutes to list the links. It took me 10 minutes to run the ad. I charged her 700 to take her up 7,000. You do not even want to know. Once I teach you to run the ad, you'll know. But for all my YouTube fam right there that, that are watching this video, you don't want to know what my profit margin is. You will pee your pants. You'd be like, holy crap, if I close two of those a week, David, you're telling me, you're telling me if I close a couple of those per week, I could be making 1200 dollars 1400 a week from home on my laptop, Wi-Fi, and my cell phone? 
like no overhead, no, no expenses, because I'm not, I'm, I'm direct messaging. I'm direct messaging. I'm hitting you on Twitter. I'm direct messaging you on Facebook. I'm direct messaging you on LinkedIn, whether it's Instagram, whatever. But mainly I do it on Facebook because on Facebook, this is what I'm showing them. I'm showing them how their pages look on Facebook. I met them on Facebook. We're friends on Facebook. You know what I mean? And so when I show them my page versus looking at their page, they're like, damn, David, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, cool. I got 500 for it. I got 500 for it. Take me up 5,000 likes, clean up my links. And then next month, now that I know what you charge to run Facebook ads, we could, we could get to that next month. And that's what happens. I'll close, I'll close three of three clients per week, make a good upfront income per week just to go do this for them. And then out of my three, six, nine, 12, out of my 12 clients for the month, three to four of them come back and say, David, I'm ready. Here's a thousand a month. Let's start running Facebook ads to my local area to capture leads. That's when I have them on a monthly retainer. And at that point, I already have a relationship with them. At that point, they're fired up because they have 4,000 likes. All their links are listed. They look legit on social media. And before me doing that for them, they didn't, they didn't look like that online. They didn't look like that. Their brand looked, looked horrible. So by this time, I'm taking them for 1000 a month, 1500 a month, 2000 a month. But, but by this time, they're fired up and they feel that they know me. And, 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 and by you starting small, you're not going to start with 10 clients right away anyways. So it's like, in the meantime, while you got your couple clients per month and you're building up your monthly portfolio, in the meantime, you're closing a couple of deals up front at 500 a pop. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So, so what else you got for me? What else? I know I, I talked way more than I needed to, but <laughs> I, I just knew that I felt like I knew where you were at with it. And, 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 and I, and I want to show you how to, how to make today money. Not, 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 not tomorrow money. Tomorrow money is that 2,500 a month. We all want those clients. That's tomorrow money. You ain't there yet. But right now, if you, if you got good at what I'm saying, you can go feed your family and, and make, make over a thousand a week on the upfront while you're bullshitting. Make, 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 make a thousand a week while you're learning your craft, while you're mastering your craft. And what is your craft? Facebook ads and Kartra. That's it. That's your craft. And, and if yeah. you can learn Facebook ads and, and Kartra, then, then you can go build a business and have as many clients as you want, if that's what you want to do, you know? Yeah, yeah. So that's definitely, I definitely wanted to get like a step-by-step -step plan on really how to begin. And I definitely feel like I have it clear now. So make sure to, you know, um, edit my page just like yours just um so i have those professional links and that way i won't look you know like an amateur and then um work on really doing the dm strategy to go get those many clients where you can boost up their like page right yes that's that those are the two services that i would that i would do for someone right away is okay. just listing all those links and taking that like count up I'm telling you, people will give you money. That's why my that's why my closing rate is so high. My closing rate is literally 99%. I have a 99% closing rate. Because people, once you show it to them, they'll be like, damn, your page does look better. Those links need to be listed. I am building a brand. I am building a business. You're right. That shit is important. And my page doesn't look like that. They see value in that. So, mm -hmm. and, and, and for you, that part is freaking easy. You can hire a five-year-old to do that for you. That's like a freaking easy ass job to customize all the links and list them. Are you kidding me? That's it's time consuming. It's time consuming if you're the only one doing it and that's fine. That's where you'll start. That's totally fine. I still do it myself. It's easy. It takes me 30 minutes and it completely turns around the whole look of their page, their personal page and their business page. And they see value in it, which there is value in it. And then I'm running their like ad. They have, they currently, they're clicking invite. They're inviting all their friends on their personal page to like their business page. They have 300 likes. It's like, dude, step your game up. Let me run a Facebook ad for you. And I'm going to take your 300 likes to 3000, whatever number they have, look at their business page. 
the like count, however many, I don't care how many it is, 200, 300, 900, whatever. Whatever many they have, I'm telling you, they don't have many. That's what I'm telling you. 100% have a few hundred, if that. I'm telling you, unless they're a big brand and they have tens of thousands of likes and they've been running Facebook ads, that's one thing. But 99% of every coach, every business page that you look at, they all have 120 likes. 99.9% of them. I already know it. I already know it. I already know it. It's a fact. I already know it. So whatever amount they have, you're 10x in it. When you're talking to them, you're, you're like, hey, man, you currently have 257 likes. I'm assuming that those are all people that, have, that are on your personal page that you're inviting. Here's what I want to do for you, coach. I want to take your 257 to 2,500. Bottom line, I want to take that number up. And to tell you the truth, I'd love to take it to 5,000. Like we need 5,000. Let me show you my page, coach, and let me show you your page, and you just let me know if there's a difference. And I'm telling you, man, anytime I show someone my like count, anytime I show them my clients like counts, where my clients 7,000, 6,000, 9,000 likes, when I show them that versus their 257 likes, they're like, holy shit, that person's a real estate agent also. And you're telling me, look, I'll take them to my page right here. Look, this is one of my boy. This is my boy right here. This is one of my ex clients or one of my clients. Let me just put it that way. One of my clients. I done this for him. This is what I've done. So when I take them, I'm talking to a prospect. We're on screen share. I'm showing them a competitive, a competitor of theirs. Cause they're in the same industry. I'm showing them my client and I'm saying, Hey man. And, and they got 305 clients. I'm showing them someone that has 9,300 likes or they have 305 likes, I'm showing them a page that has 9,300. Do you think there's a different perception there? Okay. That's, and that's what I'm saying, Sony. That's what I'm saying, is that that right there is where money's at. That right there is where money's at. This client right here, this specific, specific client paid me 900 to take him up 9,000 likes. I listed all of his links. That was step one. And then I took his like count up 9,000. He paid me $900. You don't want to know what my profit margin is because you'd probably shit your pants. <laughs> wow. And, and, and when you can do two of those per week, mm -hmm. upfront money, while you're building a relationship, while you're getting your portfolio going, while you're learning Facebook ads, while you're investing in training courses on Facebook ads, while you're perfecting and mastering your craft, at least you're making this upfront money. Now, you know what I mean? Same niche, same services that you offer. You just have different, different tiers. There's levels to the game. This is level one. Mr. Business Owner, Mr. Coach, I already know you. You're, I already know you're on level three. I get it. I already know what you want. I get it. But let me back up a little bit. Let me dumb it down and let me show you the difference in our pages. I need your pages to look like mine. Make sense, Sony? Yep. So Definitely. let's schedule the next call and we'll go from there. I appreciate your time. Yep. No problem. Thank you so much, David. You're so welcome. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. All right. Bye.